The Knicks begin their playoff journey tomorrow as the second seed in the East after beating the Bulls in the final game of the regular season. After decades of disappointment, fans are more excited than ever at this year's chances. And that includes a pair of sisters whose love for one another is matched by their love for the Knicks. CBS 2's Steve Overmeyer has their story. If you are here for the Knicks, make some noise! Around the corner from the garden... Knicks super fans come together. New York City is a Knicks city. You know, we're from Brooklyn, but we will never acknowledge the Brooklyn Nets. Jennifer and Jasmine have been known as the Knicks sisters for their entire lives. They bring their love for one another into a business showing their love for the Knicks. When one of us is weaker in some in one area, the, the other, other one, one steps, steps up. up. Our brains are connected. Our yes. souls and our hearts are connected. My mom and dad, they're like, oh my God, I don't know which one to look at, which one to listen to you guys. Are like she'll start a sentence, I'll finish it, and vice versa. We just did it. <laughs> First of all, thank you guys again for being here. Together, they create events to honor Knicks fans. We're doing something that we would want to do for ourselves, that we would want someone to do for us. <laughs> Embracing every arrival with the warmth of long lost kin. The vibe at one of our events is just energetic. It's just energy. We have banter. We're hugging. It's like a family reunion, pretty much. Their energy is infectious. Their knowledge, impressive. And we just need to stay consistent. Their faces, a canvas of emotions. We're very vocal. We're yes. very vocal. We need to be seen. We need to be heard. Specifically right. heard. Fans play a part in the game. Absolutely. We want to help to impact the win. Absolutely. And, I mean, sometimes I think we have. We have all kinds of slogans, and we <laughs> right. no easy buckets is one of them. Oh, yeah, and when there's a, 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 a bad call by the ref, it's oh. bogus. <laughs> and now that the Knicks are set for a deep playoff run, their energy is amplified. We're just that much more grateful um, for the good times because we've, we've gone to the dark <laughs> ages. <laughs> their events are representative of their mission to prove that in the world of Nick's fandom, there is a place for everyone to belong. I just want to inspire the next generation of Nick's fans, specifically young girls, young black, yes. Latina girls out there. There's a lane for us in this industry. We just hope to be an inspiring story for the youth coming up. We're all invited, and if you're lucky, you'll get to share in their roller coaster ride, one that only a true fan can understand. In Midtown, Steve Overman, CBS 2 News. Oh, man, they are spot on. I love the vibe. We just got to get that win tomorrow and get the whole series coming up.